got sexy and sweet. Oh yeah, right here. Yeah. How did you guys do tonight? It looked like it was a pretty decent night. We had a great night, and it, well, we had so fun. Get better. And whoa, whoa, <laughs> we're gonna dream about each other all night long. Oh. Yeah. I am Samantha James. I'm from Las Vegas, Nevada. And my character for right now is Strawberry Shortcake 2013. Um, I went to the costume store and my boobs were too big to fit in anything else. So that one fit and I just kind of went out there and uh, made up a story that Strawberry Shortcake was a little girl and she grew up, became a stripper in Vegas, got rope, started doing it on the strip started doing it downtown and that's what we kind of do. I remember, like this is where it all started, I remember being at Circus Circus with my mom and dad and I saw a showgirl come out and I'm like, oh I want to be a showgirl, I want to be a dancer. She's like, honey, this thing weighs so much. And I was like, I can do it. So here we are, 20 years later. I traded, I traded the top for Done that, done the stripper thing, yeah. everything yeah, else no, in the between, just come. and now I'm doing this. But I changed it from a smaller lane. From some of the people have been really helpful getting you going down there. Yes, it was um, Gene Simmons slash <laughs> Gary and um, and also the Cupid. And what, what are some of the tips they gave you when you first started? Um, to stay on your territory and stand your ground and don't let people push you around down there. And um, I kind of took me a little while to do that, but. I've got it down now to where they're not standing there if I'm standing there. Welcome to Vegas, baby. <laughs> Thank you very much. Wait, 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 one more. One more. Look at the camera. I was an escort for a very long time, very high paid. I decided to be done with the lifestyle when I had my son and I met my boyfriend so we've been together for four years obviously I'm not going to be having it being in an escort while I'm dating him um, I've been out on my own, own since I was like 16 years old so I kind of started doing massages when I was like 16 and then I started dancing when I became proper age for that and then from there that money wasn't always consistent so then um, I started doing the whole escort scene. <laughs> a picture of these kissing one. Okay, but, it, it worked really quick. Man, I'm a kiss one, okay? I didn't say suck on my stupid He sucked it. That's how I kiss. Yeah. It's an affectionate Got kiss. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. That's not <laughs> 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 He just sucked my boob. But <laughs> um, there were times in between where I would have a normal job, pizza deliveries. I've done McDonald's. I've done everything. Med tech, psych tech, um, surgical tech. I've done everything. And escorting was the highest paying job. So I took it and I got sick of it. So I quit. So I... I started selling water last summer. I got busted three times for it. I was going to do it this summer. Didn't want to deal with the police. Decided to become a character. You know what I don't get is last summer when I was doing this water selling business, they want to arrest me for selling oh, water, but now I'm not just showing my boobs. Want, I want a picture. Yeah. And some of them ride by and some of them give me a hard time. I still want a picture. <laughs> When I first started off, it was like $150, $200 a day. That lasted for like three weeks. Then it started going down to $100 and $75 and $50. And now, um, I don't know what's going on down there, but it is, you're lucky to make $30, $50 a day. And it will take all day to get that. Come here. Come here. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on over here. Come on. Yeah. Right. <laughs> yeah. This is Vegas. This is Vegas. This is Vegas. Now, turn around. <laughs> turn around. Turn around. Cameras. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Bump. Bump. Are we worth a little tip? 
A little bit. Come on. Yeah, you, you know we're worth something. Come on. She's got her boob down. Well, uh, so do I. Hey, you know what I'm thinking. Uh, <laughs> I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't blame you. Put there, but I, yeah, yeah, there. I don't blame you. Hey, okay. dude, you are the man. Wow. You are the man. <laughs> um, I get a little irritated when I know that people have money and they just want to give us a dollar, especially when there's like two of us. There'll be two of us working, and they want us to split a dollar, and I'm like, no, no, no. Can you give us a five, and then we'll split three in between? Like, they act like it's damn fucking Disneyland. This is not Disneyland, and you know it, because everybody has tips on their thing, and do you think I'm standing out there with my boobs out just so you can give me a dollar? No. How would you feel if you were standing out here trying to support your child, and somebody wants to give you a dollar to split? My dad... Um, physically and mentally abused me as a child and um, I guess I kind of just stuck around because of my mom but she could have done more to protect me but I, I look back now and I think she was just given a hand that she really just didn't know how to play like I don't think she I don't think she did not love her kids I just think that she was not equipped to deal with my dad and she had four of us I have two brothers and a sister and then me and she didn't know how she was going to take care of us so I think she stuck it out with my dad they never really have a love relationship at all and they didn't fight but my dad beat on me and which caused me to leave when I was 16 years old hi how are you thank you A lot of them ask us and they ask us why we do this and I said well I don't know why the others do it but I have a baby to take care of at the end of the day I'm the one that takes care of my kid and diapers and clothes and toys and you know things that he needs I have to get that stuff for him and I want them to know that I'm not just out there just because it's fun because it's not always fun I'm out there just like everybody else, working a regular job or hustling. I'm out there. It's a regular job. I have to be there. <laughs> tell her what order it goes in. Well, it's either sex being sweet or sex being sweet. I don't know. But either way, hey, it don't matter. We're either both ways. Oh, yeah. We're both, we're both ways. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, come on, let's make some money. Like let's, let's, let's show them how to make money out. Oh, you big boy! Next time on Surviving Vegas. I told you, Steelers everywhere, baby. Steelers everywhere. I would like to uh, take this uh, Steeler thing worldwide. You know, they raised me in a church atmosphere, and I got a lot of whippings as a kid, you know, because I was out there doing some stuff that um, I should not have been doing. You know, uh, you know, it was like, your basic bachelor crib, you know, no telling what you might see in here. Sometimes I might resort to doing something real filthy, like something like this.